How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games. We are back with another horror game. So I love when this happens. We play a demo and then there is um, an updated model a few years later. Almost a year ago now, I know because I checked on the channel, I played a game called The Lies We Tell Ourselves. There's been an updated demo and we're going to play it. There are some aspects of the game which are still like similar to the demo. And then there's more like puzzles and the stories evolved a bit more. So we're going to dive in and see what's going on in the updated demo because I love this game. Let's play the game. Okay. The lies we tell ourselves. Redone. Let's play. Oh. It's my birthday? Why are we celebrating so late? 11.15 p.m. Oh, okay, it's a party. You know it's a party when you're going on till 1 a.m. Well, this is definitely a different intro to the original demo. What's happening? Where are we going? Just partying all night? Okay. In drunken haze, he spent the night. His birthday only faded light. His mind still echo joyous songs. He's now back home where he belongs. All right, so we've been out partying. We've been celebrating a birthday. Jeez. We're feeling a little drunk. I am so wasted. Yeah. Shit. I must have forgotten my keys when I left. Rookie mistake. Nah, oh. it's way too late to ring the doorbell. Dad would kill me, birthday or not. Oh dear. Yeah, yeah, your, your parents. Maybe I can get in from the backyard door. We keep a spare key in the garden. Okay. Well, we don't feel very drunk now. We actually seem quite coherent. Dad's car, you won't let me touch that stupid accident. wasn't my fault. Yeah. You are coming home drunk as shit, though. Dad would kill me. Okay, so we still live with our dad. We've been out partying. It's nearly the next day. And we hide a key. In the garden. Shift to run. I know. Where are we getting in here? Is it this door? God damn it. Of course it's stuck. Maybe I can get in from Mr. Morangi's shack. The secret passage near the bushes should still be open. Oh shit. Oh, we got legs! And a really nice belt buckle! Damn, I'm in good shape. Okay, crouch. Okay. George and I used to sneak in and out all the time when we were kids. <laughs> Step on it with your massive boot. God damn. I haven't seen Morangi in years. Who knows what happened to him? Why is our voice all echoey? And why don't I have a flashlight? I can't see shit. Yep. I better turn the lights on. Much uh... better. I want these lights for my garden. I feel like they'll they'll be really uh, pretty. This place is possibly even worse than I remember. Mm, this pile of trash might be useful. I just need to stack one more box and I could climb over the fence. All right, give me a box now. Thank you. I'll take that and I'll put that here. Oh, what what's this? What's this electric thing? That's very glamorous. Alright, we're going over. I thought we were trying to get into our own home. Why are we now going okay. to the neighbours? Here we go. This is what you do when you're drunk, isn't it? <laughs> everything's, everything's ten times more. Yep. Now we don't know who we are. Oh shit, okay. I'm actually alive. Home sweet home. Ah. <sighs> The spare key should be hidden behind the lamp to the left of the door. Lamp to the left of the door. Okay, got it. All right. Wow, that's quite nice. They like their pot plants. These are more indoor the plants. Hell? Did they really change the entrance while I was out? Oh shit! That doesn't look like a human door. You hit your head. That's what it is. At the end of the game, we're going to wake up with a head injury. The key is hidden behind the yellow lamp. On the left of the door. Hello. There it is. That's actually quite a cool hiding space. Why is it half a key? We got half a key. Use the lock. 
To avoid the burglars finding the obvious spot, we bought a special two-part magical key. Top half should be attached to the one on the bench's legs. I've never heard of that in my life! You cut a key in half? There it is. God damn it's so stupid. Never, never in my life have I heard of that. It's locked. Okay, I need to like... Yeah, I don't think that exists. Oh, fucking finally. Yeah, we're in. Home sweet home. Dad, I got some drunk shit to tell you. Oh, in a drunken stumble, he found a way to where he to where he thought he'd always stay, but darkness hid what once had shone. The house was never truly home. Oh dear. Okay, I can't see anything. Why is it so dark? Turn the light on. Is the power out? Okay, here's the room from the demo. Do you remember this now, guys? Oh, shit. Hey, Reed, I've been watching you. I've seen what you've become, and it hurts me. You can't escape me anymore, not even here. Among comforts you've earned and knowledge you've never craved. You just took it and ruined it, all of it. I will do the same to you. I will make you see whatever you want it not. Okay. Probably a jealous ex. All right, yeah, I remember this room now. Where the hell am I? Oh, okay. Let's see if all the puzzles are still the same, though. Yeah, here's the toilet what with the, the branches hell? growing out of it. So filthy. It's a dream world. Okay, right, let's take a look around and see what we got. I remember looking in this mirror at the painting, and it was like a different way around, and that kind of unlocked it. It seems like something used to be hanging on that wall. It's missing now. What the hell? Shit. Can't remember if- Hold oh, on, let me turn that off. I can't stand that shit. Alright, socky note. Check. Choices made. Choices buried so deep inside to feel like lies. You believed them to be all behind you in the past, but the past made you who you are today. Who's to blame? Ooh, shit. Do I take that with me or I'm just gonna leave that there? Okay. Oh! Mom's paintings. What the hell are they doing here? Why oh, can I rotate it? I can rotate them. Okay, I think I remember these. Yeah. Things just kind of appear in this game. Alright, so we got that. Now, I, I do remember something in this mirror. Something in this mirror triggered something. What's that? A big cactus. Right, thanks for clearing that up. Oh my shit. Another drippy letter. Read. What's ugly and black and filthy inevitably permits the safest of spaces. It's been with you all along, but you choose to ignore it. To set things in motion and see, you must start from within. Look inside yourself and beyond. Embrace what's missing and drown it. What do you mean? What do you mean? And there's the safe with the drippy stuff. Remember this? Oh, fuck. Yeah, we, de we definitely drunk some neat vodka last night. That's what's happening here. Alright, I don't really know what the next step is. Ah, uh, there was a valve behind the television. Yes. Okay, let's try and fig figure this out. Hmm. Ah, there we go. There's something wrong with the reflection. See? The painting's now here. Okay, that's not changed. This portrait... Mom painted it when I was a child. Wow. She was happy back then. For a while, at least. To be honest, you were a good kid to just sit there for have that painting done. Okay. Sweetie. That's new. Welcome, that didn't happen before. <laughs> what was that? Okay. This is new. And that's weird. What's that? Is that a cat? Mr. What did he say? Oh. Unbelievable. This is... Is this our room? My childhood room? It's quite a badass room, to be honest. Okay. Don't step on the cat. 
Mr. Wiggly was my favourite. Dad always thought it was too girly for me. That's not girly! Mr. Wiggly's all man! Got a little teepee? Damn, I was a small kid. I've grown. Bunny lamp. Plastic spaceship. My stuffed whale. Wow, we... We liked all species. What's this? Okay. What's wrong with his tail? Oh, it curls. I thought his tail was chopped off. Alright, dinosaurs. We get it. A boy lives here. I made up a fun game to teach me basic math. Ball equals two teddies. I think mum needs to work on her math. I'm not going to lie. Okay, typical ball. <gasps> Is that Thor's hammer? Is that Thor's hammer? This kid knows what's up. Just saying. Okay. Oh, crap. I bet that wasn't there when you were a kid. Okay, this box doesn't belong here. No, I bet not. Alright, so we got a three, four combination lock. We need to look around to find out what that is. I bet it's mum's math. Hmm, I'm looking around. Is it not mum's math? Let me look at the symbols again. Oh. Six. There's a, is that a six or a G? That looks like a six behind the Triceratops. Okay, hold on a second. It has to have something to do with this. Okay, so a Rubik's Cube. What is uh, a Rubik's Cube equals Triceratops? So where was the a Rubik's Cube? Okay, so that's got an arrow on it. There's nothing else on it. So there's a little arrow on the blue cube there. Um, and the Triceratops says six. So arrow equals six plus what what's on the brontosaurus one okay so arrow equals six so that's seven minus whatever the t-rex is five so there's two right two so, okay. Hmm. So if that is so the arrow is the second one, right? So if I go here, oh I've already done it. Yeah, that's the second one. Right. So the teddy bears make the sum of the symbol. Okay, so the first one, all right. So that was the that was the second line, which is already done. I actually got that right by mistake. So the first one Ball. So which is the ball? Where's the ball? Here it is. Wait, what's that noise? That that symbol there. Is that a symbol? The square with the little snowflake type thing inside of it? Let me just check. Hmm, okay, let's just let's just pretend that symbol's that. So there's two bears and their faces are slightly different. Then one nose is turned down triangular, one is up, so the up one is this this sounds so confusing but stay with me it makes makes kind of sense try and find the the sum oh my god i love a good puzzle that's challenging all right seven so he has a seven there on his arm so seven minus three it's four okay so the fourth one along is that symbol on the ball Did it. Did it. I had two symbols round the wrong way, but we did it. All right, let's open it up. That was a tough puzzle. Like, you had to really think. Okay, today is the worst. John is just an arsehole, not helping at all. Poor Vinny. He's so young and innocent, I'm afraid for him the most. Dr. Stratus wants to increase the dosage. I think he knows he can help me and just wants to kill me instead. It's easier that way. His secretary always has that look on her face. All right. All right, well, that was a ridiculously hard puzzle. Let's get out of here. Is that it? We're just, we're just doing the note? Mr. Oh, Wiggly. Mr. Wiggly. Did I draw this? <sighs> the key lies with Mr. Wiggly. What do you know, Mr. Wiggle? Did you set I'm this puzzle up? Starting to remember. He's beginning to believe. That day, Mom was having one of her episodes. She was certain I had stolen something from her room. 
What did you steal? What would you steal from your mum's room as a young boy? She started trashing the place, searching everywhere. I was freaking out. Hugging Mr. Wiggly in the teepee. You need to put Mr. Wiggly down, you're too old for that shit. She took it out of my hands. I love the slippers. I started crying. And that's when she ripped its head off. Oh. My. God. He ain't wiggling now! Huh? Got a key. Put it down. Put that down. Jesus. You're a very disturbed little boy. Don't take it out on bunny lamp. Sweetie. Oh open dear. Open the door, please. Now I'm good, Mum. Don't really like you. Read some notes. Please let me in. M Mr. Wrigley's bleeding. Open the damn door now. Jesus Christ. Don't do it. Then sent open the fucking door. Then sent open the open the damn door now. Hell out of here. Ah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, mother. Then sent open the fucking door. Fuck this shit. Ah. Oh, you're grounded. You. Literally. Okay, we made it back. Wow, all right, we get it. Childhood trauma. How is this linked God, to me being drunk? It. Back to whatever the fuck this is. All right, so we're back in the weird room. Okay, so that now changed. Stop playing music. Okay, and we can't look in there because, well, we've done that now. We've done that puzzle. We still have to get in here. Home sweet home, anyway. Um. Oh. Oh, disgusting. Oh! God almighty. It's locked. Oh, I got a key. Yeah, and we got the valve. Now, I remember that bit. I remember that bit. That valve goes on the thing behind the telly. <coughs> Boom. Turn that sludge off. Yeah. Yeah. Slowly does it. Don't break a nail. Ooh, now the safe is open. The radio. What the hell? Don't don't get too close. What are you doing in here, son? I'm making an axe. But this wood is too slippery to grip. Can you help me? Oh, now you want an axe. You're always using my tools to mess around with your little projects. I'm a kid. How many have you started so far? Uh, I don't know. Fifty or so? And how many have you finished? Fifteen. Uh, three. Maybe you should think about more important stuff than all this bullshit. Go wash your hands. Dinner's ready. But, Dad... Now! Okay. I didn't need a stupid axe anyway. Fifteen. Three? Is that the code? Fifteen, three? It's a free digit! Ah, 50 and 3. Was it? I thought he said 15 to begin with. There we go. An axe blade! I'll take Enough that. Enough with the fucking letters! Yeah, as you wish. Oh dear. Okay. Now, what do I use the axe for? Is that to maybe open the chest? Use it here. Okay, the radio is giving me the creeps. That's going off. Okay, give me, give me like a handle here. Is this a handle? I'll take that. All right, and let's combine. Oh, I do need some like tape or something. Okay, where can I get some tape? Is that my phone? Okay, I've still got my phone. 
It's a cheap Apple ripoff, but, you know, it, it does the job. Duct tape. Boom. <gasps> All right. Done. We have an axe. Yes! We're hacking our way in! Alright, last time, if I remember correctly, in, in the other demo, a massive worm came out. Yep, there it is. That hasn't changed. Jesus. They kept that one in. Alright, we're going in. Ooh. Yep, that's what you get for going in a worm-infested wardrobe in a nightmare world. Oh, shit. Okay. This Ooh. is possibly the worst moment. <laughs> of your life? Yeah, I or? can't stop thinking about that stupid axe. Why? That day with my dad, something changed. It wasn't just the day I stopped sneaking into his tool shed. It was the day I gave up on something I really enjoyed doing. Creating axes? I never thought about it. But part of me died that day. I, I think that's a bit dramatic. Like, your dad just doesn't want you making 53 axes. It's not normal. Okay. Ah, yes. I'm remembering this now. And yeah, we we somehow get behind here, don't we? Yeah, this part of the demo is very much the same. But we keep playing it just to see if anything is uh, a bit different. Right, something attached to this, so maybe I can climb down. All right, let's go get a rope. Ropey time! Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, yeah. I remember that bit. That bit's not changed. Okay. Give me. Aha! There's the, there's the chain. Take it. Jesus. Just keep running. I have to get the hell out of here. Yep. Yep. Time to move. What the hell? Dangly dangle. Just go. All this because I came home drunk. Okay. Hopefully it'll hold. It's chain. We're not that heavy. Jesus. What the fuck am I doing? Just go. What the thing is still around somewhere. Okay, fuck it. On three. One. Two. I made the choice for you! Fuck! Are we impaled? Fuck! To hell we go. Alright. Jesus Christ. Okay, so some updates there. Um, nothing major. There's a bit more backstory going on. A bit more uh, of a drunken intro. That was really interesting. But still nothing like... Nothing too deep. We've just got a bit of an insight into an abusive relationship there that he had with his mother. But a cool game nonetheless. I don't know when this game is going to have a full release because ever since, uh, even in the last demo, we fell down the hole and we still haven't seen what's at the bottom. So there's a big game coming in the future and I will play it. Guys, I have decided to um, edit the end of this video properly. <laughs> And not just leave you with uned unedited endings, which has been happening. Apologies. I've been very busy and distracted. So yeah, like, love, cross my channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay dazzling. <laughs>